Hello everybody, Marta Harding here, welcome to my channel Marta Harding Art. Today I thought I'd show you all the different types of brushes I use um, for my painting styles and techniques. Um, I'll show you the colours, Titanium White, Cabin Yellow Light, Permanent Lizard, Ultramarine Blue and Burnt Umber. These are the only five colours I've got. This Lizard Crimson is dripping down, that's alright. I'll show you the brushes I use and why I use them. I use um, half a dozen different types of brushes really. This is a... Um, a filbert brush it's a long head filbert brush i use this a lot for landscapes and still lifes especially still lifes it's really good for still lifes um it's good for 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 uh for that type of thing and i'll just darken this here i'll show you it's good for it's good for painting trees and things um, different textures of the trees. And I use these brushes here, which is a sword brush. Um, very interesting brush. It's like a dagger brush, but it's, um, it's a lot more finer. And I use this, these are good for, um, for things like, uh, branches and branches of trees. For example, if you want to, uh, paint leaves and branches of a trees or, or grassy edges like this here this is really good for a landscape i use this a lot on the landscape paintings actually lots of different um tall grass area here if you want to paint branches and leaves of trees as well it's really good for that type of thing and i really like i really like the uh, sword brush for that type of thing really really good for that type of thing flat brushes are a must you've got to have flat brushes they're really good for everything um flat brushes if you want to paint you know you want to paint something that's like a side of a building or something it's got that uh it's got that really good detail and you can get you can get the uh, accuracy along with it as well you know you can you know if this is a, as a this is a window or something you know, you can paint that the window. It's got um, so many uses for for these type of brushes here. Really good type of thing. You could good techniques. I've used it on the side here. You can get grass specks, tall grass coming up. A really good brushes, flat brushes for all those type of uses. This is one of my favorite type of brushes there. Fan brush. I use a fan brush all the time. Um, if you want to paint, um, you want to paint grass. I do a lot of fan brushes for grass here. It's a really good, good brush for, for painting grass. Um, has a really good effect on the grass, as you can see. I use fan brushes all the time for, for painting grass because I just love this type of thing. You can paint it for trees as well. You can put them on trees as well. And, and grass, you can use them this way. I mainly use them for grass because they're a really good uh, effect. And of course you've got the round brushes. I don't use a lot of round brushes, but they do come in handy. Um, they do come, they're usually for portrait type of paintings, but you can use them for all sorts of things. You can, they're good for a, for flower painting as well. For painting flowers, you can, you can put them on, on flowers and you can put details on them. All those type of details are really good for that. And of course, I've got dagger brushes as well, which is probably the last I use. I don't use a lot of dagger brushes, but um, dagger brushes are, you can use them on the side or you can use them like this here. <clears throat> dagger brushes are good for landscapes and trees, and they're good for hair as well. If you want to do hair on someone, but they're quite good for uh, for that type of thing. As you can see, and you can cover a lot of, you can get good gradient with them as well. Uh, a, lot, a lot of people use these for mount, painting mountains because you get good gradient, as you can see. You see the gradient that goes along here. That's quite good, good gradient techniques on it. And so this is a, these are the type of brushes I use for all these type of paintings. So um, that's the type of brushes I use. And uh, you've got a variety of brushes. 
um, it really helps when painting and uh, if you like this video like share subscribe and bang the bell hope you like the video and we'll catch you guys later